Hello students in junior high. Today we are going to learn how to use use to. First, we have to understand something and to have something in mind. Use to expresses a past habit. What is a habit? That is a frequent action in the past. So understanding that, we are going to go to the next slide. First, imagine you that you are that baby, right? You were a beautiful baby. And I asked you, did you do this action, for example, drink milk or crawl on the floor? Maybe you are asking yourself, what is crawl? Or you ask me, teacher, what is crawl? Well, crawl is to put your hands, your knees, and your feet on the floor and to start moving, right? So, uh, that is crawl, that is similar, creep. Or the next one. You slept more than eight hours. Maybe you're now as an adolescent. You sleep more less less than eight hours. Maybe you are sleeping six or five hours if you watch movies or you see Netflix in that night, right? But a baby on slept more than eight hours. Maybe fourteen or maybe sixteen hours. Now, if you see here, we use we were using use two, and we are going to use some of the actions that we have upper right you have I used to drink milk or you can say too I used to crawl on the floor or you could say I used to sleep more than eight hours when you were a baby no actually right because uh, in currently you cannot do it but just check when you use used to that verb has to be with ed because that is a regular verb used to now let's check how to use it because you have a verb after that. Now, what about the past? Just you are the same baby, and you you had these actions because you couldn't do it. For example, you couldn't run fast, right? Or could you run fast? No. Or you couldn't speak fluently. Maybe you could say some words. For example, mom, dad, milk, car. But you cannot connect the ideas, or you cannot connect words words to make an idea or you couldn't go to school maybe you went to school but that is in the elementary school or kindergarten but now no you couldn't go now we are going to use used to but in negative is i didn't used to right for example here you have used but here you are going to use only used no used no with the right and we are going to make a sentence. I didn't used to run fast. Or I didn't used to speak fluently. Or I didn't used to run fast. Now, let's check how to use it in question. Here you have question words, but we are going to explain that later. First, in all of the questions, you have to consider to use did always did right because that is a question so we are I'm going to circle here did and we are going to use it did you use to and you have an action uh -huh. for example I'm going to ask did your mom use to study English uh -huh. again did your mom use to study English and you answer, yes, my mom is used to study English or not. My mom didn't used to study English. Remember, positive, used. Negative, didn't use. You don't have to use the letter D. Now, this person or this uh, emoji represents a subject. It can be a place, a thing, an animal or people, right? So they can be for, uh, for all, of the, all of that. But you have to consider to use did for all of the subjects. Now we are going to use the same question, but using a question word. Maybe, maybe you remember what is question words. They are. I'm going to write here. For example, what. For example, where. Or for example, when. As others. For example, you can use here how many. It can be another, right? So we are going to use a question word with the same question. 
The question was, did your mom used to study English? Now I'm going to be specific. Where, where did your mom used to study English? Again, where did your mom used to study English? And you answer, my mom used to study English at home or my mom used to study English at Liceo Tullyahualco, right? Maybe your mom studied at Liceo Tullyahualco too, right? As you do it now. We are going to use another example, right? With the same structure, with the question word, we did, the subject used to, and the, the, the action, right? Don't forget to use the question mark at the end. Now, we are checking another, right? With the same question. When, now the question word is when. When did your mom used to study English? Uh -huh. And I repeat the question. When did your mom used to study English? And maybe you could answer, my mom used to study English every Saturday, right? She's not studying actually in this um, currently. Now, right now, he, she's not studying, right? So that is a frequent past action. So we are going to return to the first slide. And remember, you have an activity, as it is mentioned in the um, activities weekly format. Do, do the activity in Kahoot. You have to enter the pin that is mentioned there. Right. If you have any doubts, so so you can uh, express your doubts during the sessions of Zoom. Remember to check the schedule when it is uh -huh, and what time. It is going to be every day, but uh, check the schedule uh, to check the time you have to enter. Please hope you enter every day to, to solve some doubts. Maybe not English, but with other subjects, right? So see you later. Bye.